In this tutorial, we will go through the addition of two digit numbers. Now, the addition of two digit numbers, or any numbers larger than this, is a lot easier to work out if you know how to use the vertical format, also known as long addition. Let's work through an example. What is 46 plus 2? A nice easy example. Let's write this down in the vertical format. 46 plus 2. Note how we write this down in columns. The first column is called units, the next column is tens. We can label them, uh, we don't have to. When we are adding using the vertical format, we add column by column. We always start with the column on the right. So let's do this. The column on the right, what is 6 plus 2? 6 plus 2 that's right, it's 8. Now we will add the tens column. What is 4 plus 0? The answer is 4. 46 plus 2 is 48. A nice easy one to begin with. That was adding two digit number with a one digit number. Now we will work through adding a two digit number with another two digit number. Let's work through an example. What is 34 plus 42? Again, let's write this down in the vertical format. 34 plus 42. The key to doing any of these questions is to make sure that we get the format of this right. Always write the number below the top number. The 2 is written below the 4, the 4 is written below the 3. Now let's do this again, starting with the right hand column. What is 4? plus 2. That's right, it's 6. We now turn to the next column. What is 3 plus 4? That's right, it is 7. 34 plus 42 is 76. Again, a nice easy one. Now what if the numbers in one of the columns adds to 10 or more? Let's work through an example so that we know how to do this. What is 27 plus 45? Let's write this down in the vertical com uh, vertical format. You have a go as well how to do this. 27, 45, don't forget the plus sign. Now, the same way we did the previous two examples, we add the column on the right first. 7 plus 5. What is 7 plus 5? That's right, it's 12. How do we write this down? We don't write 12 here, that would be wrong. What we do is the 1 in the number 12 we write down here. The 2 goes over here, that is 12. The 1 becomes part of the tens column. Some people like to add the 1 here, or maybe up here. 
it doesn't really matter. This is the best format to write the 1 over here. Now let's add the tens column. 2 plus 4 plus 1. Don't forget this. 2 plus 4 is... That's right, it's 6. Plus 1 is... 7. Let's just go through this again to make sure that we fully understand this. 27 plus 45. We add the units first, which is 7 plus 5. We put the 1 down here. We put the 2 over here. Then we add the tens column. 2 plus 4 plus 1. It is 7. Therefore, 27 plus 45 is 72. That wasn't difficult, was it? It's very simple. Now, what if we have a scenario where both of these columns add to 10 or more? Let's work through an example. What is 65 plus 58? Now, does that look difficult? It may be difficult, but if we use the vertical format, it's going to be very straightforward. So let's write these numbers down in the vertical format. We write down 65 plus 58. Again, we write them down, make sure that they're, right, that they're written in columns. So let's add them together. What is 5? plus 8. 5 plus 8 is... That's right, it's 13. Do you remember how to write the numbers down? We put the 1 here, the 3 goes over here. 13. Now, let's add the tens column. We've got 6 plus 5 plus 1. Let's go through this. 6 plus 5 is, that's right, it's 11. 11 plus 1 is 12. Now, how do we write the 12 here? The same format we use to do this. We put the 1 here in the new column, and we put the 2 over here. This is the units column. That's the tens column. The one next to it is the hundreds column. So over here, now we add the hundreds column. 0 plus 0 is 0. Plus the 1 is 1. So 65 plus 58 is 123. That's how easy it is. It's not very difficult. Let's work through one more example. What is 57 plus 94? Now you're thinking the two large numbers here, this is going to be quite difficult. But if we write them correctly in the vertical format, this is going to be very simple. So let's write them down. 57 plus 94. Again, we start with a column on the right. What is 7 plus 4? 7 plus 4. That's right. It's 11. How do we write that? Put the 1 here and the 1 over here. 11. Now we add the tens column. What is 5 plus 9 plus 1? Now the easy way to do this is to add the 9 and the 1 we know that makes 10. 10 plus 5 is 15. Let's write that down. 1 and 5 is 15. The hundreds column, there's 0 and 0 and 1. The answer is 151. 57 plus 94 is 151. So there we have it. That is 
the addition of two digit numbers. Always remember, if you get a question like this, it's a lot easier to write it in the vertical format. Make sure you write them in nice, neat columns so that you can do the addition part. And when the teacher is marking them, the teacher can also see how you've done it. And that's it. It's as simple as that.